in the, in the context, uh, in this wide context that is going on right now, uh, about racism. Because everybody's being accused of racism. Racism is just thrown about by the left primarily, constantly, about anybody who disagrees with them about anything. It's gotten to the point where the term means nothing the way they are using it. But I think it's an important term. I think it's an important term because it captures something really essential. And I think it's an important term because properly understood, it demonstrates that the way the left is behaving and using the term racism makes them racists. Racism is the act of judging a person, not based on his character, not based on his qualities, not based on who and what he is, but based on the insignificant characteristics of skin color, or ethnic background, or genetic makeup. When that is irrelevant, when that is irrelevant, So viewing whites in a particular way, not particular whites, based on their particular character and their particular characteristics, but talking about whites is racist. Talking about blacks is racist. I mean, treating them as members of a group rather than as individuals. So the whole critical race theory is a racist theory. The whole idea that we are determined by our so-called race, as if there was such a thing, is racism. Now there's, you know, If you're black and part of the middle class, or maybe you're black and a conservative, then they call you white because your views are white views. They associate views with color of skin. They want to cancel the study of Greece and Rome, not because they don't like the ideas. They're not complaining about the ideas of Greece. They're complaining about the fact that Greeks were white. The idea that there's white math, these are racist views. They need to be called out as racist views. These are abhorrent, disgusting. And these people should be canceled by civilized society. So when I use racist, and I hope when you use racist, it denotes the treating of an individual or of a group of individuals, not based of, of, of assigning an individual some kind of group characteristic and ignoring, ignoring their character. Again with the casting urn, yes, I, I don't understand. If you have the power to inflict pain on them, then they, I wish we had the power to cancel them in a sense of they should be fired. They're not academics. They're not worthy of the term academic. They, they should not be teachers at universities. These people should be kicked out of universities for the garbage, trash that they are teaching. So that is consistent with canceling, I think. Now, maybe somebody will write to me and tell me I'm wrong. But that seems to be the right. Now, we don't have the power to do that. So we can't cancel them. But I wish we could.
it can be that cancel culture can only it can only refer even in theory only to the left. No, it it, it refers to a phenomena that could be that could anybody, if they had the cultural power, could participate in. What we need today, what I call the new intellectual, would be any man or woman who is willing to think. Meaning, any man or woman who knows that man's life must be guided by reason, by the intellect, not by feelings, wishes, whims, or mystic revelations. Any man or woman who values his life and who does not give, want to give in to today's cult of despair, cynicism, and impotence and does not intend to give up the world to the dark ages and to the rule of the collectivist brutes. All right, before we go on, reminder, please like the show. We, we've got 163 live listeners right now, uh, 30 likes. That should be at least 100. I figure at least 100 of you actually like the show. Maybe there are like 60 of the Matthews out there who hate it. But, but at least the people who are liking it, you know, I want to see I want to see a thumbs up. There you go. Start liking it. I want to see that go to 100. All it takes is a click of a, a, click of a, a thing, whether you're looking at this. Uh, and, and, you know, the likes matter. It, it's not an issue of my ego. It's an issue of the algorithm. The more you like something, the more the algorithm likes it. So, you know, and if you don't like the show, give it a thumbs down. Let's see your actual views being reflected in the likes but uh, if you like it, don't just sit there, help get the show promoted. Of course, you should also share, and uh, you can support the show at yourownbookshow.com slash support, or on Patreon, or Subscribestar, or Locals, uh, and, uh, and show your support for, all, for, for, for the work, for the value, hopefully, you're receiving from this. And, uh, and of course, don't forget, if you're not a subscriber, even if you... Even if you just come here to troll, or even if you're here like Matthew to defend Marx, uh, then uh, you should subscribe, because that way you'll know when to show up. You'll know what shows are on, when they're on. You'll get notified. Right? So, um, yes, like, share, subscribe, support. Like, share, subscribe, support. There you go. Easy. Do one or all of those, please.